Hi world, uh, here tonight, just got a little um, little tarantula bite here, you can see its uh, fangs have a nice width to them, sweet little bite by a Versicolor, no big deal. It's nothing like Rob C's bite by his Ornata, even though my arm is throbbing, just kidding. So anyway, tonight what we're here to look at is the Green Bottle Blue or uh, Chromatopelma Sinopubescence. This is an amazingly beautiful tarantula. It's got the metallic blue legs, the blue-green carapace, and the orange abdomen. So this is not, per se, uh, an aggressive species. However, they can be nervous. I'm not handling this one because uh, they tend to flick hairs, and obviously I just got bit, not that I care. But, anyway, we're gonna throw this girl a uh, cricket and see if she'll chow down. So this is a uh, medium sized, medium growing species. Uh, I don't know if I said they're from Venezuela, which a lot of the beautiful tarantulas of the world are. Um, this is a desert tarantula, so you don't want to keep them too wet. They are terrestrial, so they need a wider enclosure than a taller enclosure. We've got this one here on vermiculite. They do tend to web, kind of a tunnel web in the wild, which, um, you know, that helps protect them from predators, trap insects, and uh, just kind of keeps, uh, it's just a barrier between the harsh desert climate and uh, their little home. So this is uh, one of my favorite tarantulas because of its beauty and its temperament. They can tend to run off, so you do have to watch for that. But um, as I said, not a particularly aggressive species. This is not a spider that's gonna come after you. So I've got another one here. Um, as I said, even though they're docile, they can be possessive and show some threatening dis dip behavior. They can bite or, or more commonly just kick hairs. So the nice thing about these tarantulas is that since they don't need to be kept too wet, they don't, they're not that hard to care for. We spray down our adult cages only once a week and our uh, sling cages two to three times a week. So, um, beautiful bug, one of my favorites. You can see this one here is going to put on a little show. And um, I think that's all we've got tonight. This is an awesome bug to have in any collection. And uh, these are mine. So I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.